Welcome everyone. Thanks for joining me. I'm back after a long hiatus. And uh, what was my last video? Maybe around Halloween, I think. Something like that. I don't know. I wanted to stop off, get some gas, and you know, get some snacks, whatever. You know, fun little day to take a road trip. But I'm not just at any gas station. I'm at probably one of the most famous gas stations in America. I am at the one and only Bucky's. We're going to go inside here. We're going to check this place out. Show you some of the little fun things they've got in here. And if you've not been here, it's kind of like the Jungle Gems of gas stations. You remember Jungle Gems, the crazy, uh, quirky grocery store I went to in Ohio. Uh, these uh, are kind of spread out to the U.S. And uh, they're not... They're kind of scarce where they're at. This one took me about a two-hour drive to get to down here in Richmond. But this is a really cool place. My first time coming here. I'm excited to see this. When you walk into Bucky's, you never realize how much useless stuff they have here that you really don't need. Like a Bucky's pet bowl. A dog bowl, but I'm sure your cat could probably use it too. I mean... Just uh, has a sticker of uh, Bucky on there. You got uh, another dog toy. So much silly stuff that they got here. Another uh, like a dog toy. They've also got uh, Bucky's uh, travel cups, collapsible travel cups. He's got Bucky on there. And if you're looking for some nice high-end sunglasses, they do have them here. You got Oakley's here, which is my favorite brand. They've also got Ray-Bans. But be prepared to spend a lot. And of course, you gotta have Bucky's beanie caps, a scarf, some little like fishing like hats. Now here's something I've never seen, a tumbler handle. I mean you, you can't just hold it, you can't just hold the tumbler with your hand, you gotta have these now. That to me is just laziness. Reusable straws. Now, it's not very many gas stations you see that has stuff for hunting. For deer hunting and other hunting essentials. And you've got hearing protection and stuff for your shooting targets if you case you want to get some target practice in. Some more targets down there. Gun cases. It's just incredible. You know, you wouldn't think you'd find something like that at a gas station. But you find it here at Bucky's. You got waterproof phone cases. Stick your phone down in there, seal it up, and protect your phone if you drop it in the water. I will admit, I've, I've got one, something like this, and they actually do work. Take it to the water park with you, get it wet, and you don't have to worry about your phone getting damaged. And of course, right here, about the middle of the store, you got this old pickup truck full of Bucky plush toys. But if those are too big for you, you got little keychain size ones down here and you little buckets or baskets, whatever. Summer's coming if you need some swimming trunks. You get some Bucky themed swim trunks. I am kind of disappointed they don't have fishing gear here. Like is this way. 
the lake is that way. This way. That way. The lake's this not. Way. Yeah, I know. This I don't way. see. I don't see the lake over that way. There is no lake over that way. Well, oh, there is some yummy food over there. I'll talk about it in a minute. Looks like somebody set their food down. Forgot about it. That ain't good. I do like these. Well, those are a lot heavier than I thought they were. It's got some weight to them. These things are heavy too. Hey, go on. Oh. Okay. Stay. <laughs> got a little, like a, uh, like a, like, I don't know if you want to call that a coat rack, hat rack, key rack. I guess it's whatever you want it to be. Well, that'd be good to get a little photo put in there. I gotta. I don't think it'd be a good idea to put a photo of your girl in a bear's mouth. You might get in trouble for that, man. But then again, maybe the girl would put a picture of her boyfriend in there saying that he's a bear. If you put a picture of your girl in there, guys, you put a picture of your girl in there and that she might think that you're calling her an old bear. That could land you in a lot of trouble. Speaking of women, beware of wife. Dog is friendly. I could get in a lot of trouble with that sign. Trying a new workout routine. Today, I did diddly squats. <laughs> I, I am lazy sometimes. These, I like these signs. They're actually pretty funny. In case anybody's in the market for cow skulls that are decorated all weirdly, there you go. They have like a bunch of these cattle skulls too. Look at this. Look at this one. This one's all bedazzled up. And you got this one over here that's blue. My favorite color. You know, the, the people here who run Bucky's, they must be huge dog people or something because I see a lot of dog stuff. Like back there, they had a bunch of back on the other one. Uh, back behind me a little bit they had some dog stuff uh, over here they got more dog stuff but well, they do have some cat stuff too but not as much as I think is what they do dog stuff I mean but you know back there they had a bunch of dog toys dog bowls so I guess here's more dog stuff down here there's more dog stuff I don't know if that's really appropriate well, it's kind of inappropriate how them dogs are lying but okay whatever <laughs> I think that's actually kind of funny. Dog walked. Dog needs a walk. Hey, look, I didn't know my sister was here. What a surprise. <laughs> She'd shoot me if she heard me saying that. Good thing she don't watch these videos. Anybody remember that cartoon from Manomaniac's Chicken Boo? You're not a man, you're a chicken boo. Dorothy sometimes acts like a big wood chicken. <laughs> For you drinkers, they got plenty of stuff for you here. They got some uh, taps and some glasses, shakers, and everything else. Some bottle openers. They got a whiskey cigar glass set. I really don't know if anybody needs that, but all right. These are pretty cool. These are uh, uh, a three-bottle granite wine rack. You got uh, another tap. Those are actually pretty cool looking. That's a neat idea. Me, I would probably see if I could put like something like Coke or Pepsi in one of these and have it on tap or Big Red. I would love to have Big Red on tap. That'd be great. And in case you're wondering, yes, they do have Bucky aprons. <laughs> oh goodness. 
One of the best things about here is they've got briskets and pulled pork and well you could read it up on there. All fresh too, all freshly made sandwiches. Not something that's been sitting out underneath the warmer for you know past two weeks. Freshly made, it's absolutely delicious here. For you sweet tooth people like me, I love this. Big old chocolate chip cookies. Look at the size of those cinnamon rolls on there. Huge! Beaver chips. Chicken burritos, fajitas. And if you love jerky, they got you covered. All the way down there, it's just nothing but jerky. Look at that. Ghost pepper. Pepper turkey. Curry and barbecue. I mean, the list just goes on and on. I'm not a jerky eater myself, but I know plenty of people that are, and they'd be in heaven to see all this. Oh man, there's something more for you sweet tooth lovers. They got fudge. Oh my gosh. This is absolutely amazing. You even got your own little Bucky phone holders. Set your phone down there and it holds it up for you. Got a water bottle, little tumbler cups, more tumblers here. Tumblers. And they got stuff here that you'd never really, I've never seen really in even in grocery stores. Pickled quail eggs. I don't know of anywhere, I've, I mean I've never really looked, but still, I don't think I've ever really seen many places carry quail eggs. Pickled quail eggs is that. And you got your regular spicy pickled eggs. Pickled asparagus. You got a big selection of jams. Strawberry banana. Prickly pear cactus jam. Grandma Gigi's pepper jelly. I don't know how good that would be. <laughs> yogurt pretzels. Cinnamon flavored yogurt pretzels. That, that's yeah, that doesn't sound too appetizing to me. And they didn't leave out you hot sauce lovers. Stuff that people that really like the, the real hot stuff. Of course, some of the soda is probably not too bad, but oh, probably the ghost pepper might, might be the hottest thing here. I'm not a hot sauce person. I don't like to eat that hot of sauce. I could stand a little bit, but oh, you got uh, Carolina Reaper there too. That's probably... I don't know which is hotter, the Carolina Reaper or the ghost pepper. Everybody's got their different opinions on what they think is hotter. Has anybody ever done the one chip challenge? If you have, let me know. Hopefully nobody had to go to the hospital for that. Coconut peanut brittle. Mm. Jalapeno peanut brittle. Ugh. Oh my gosh. I love banana chips. I used to eat those. I used to eat these when I was a kid growing up. I haven't had them in years. I'm going to have to probably get me a bag of these. So I'm not eating those in forever. Milk chocolate raisins. I love ices. What flavors do you like? Me, I like uh, wild cherry and blue raspberry. Dorothy, what flavor do you like on ices? The uh, Dr. Pepper Frozen? 
You could talk, you know, you don't have to be silent in this video. She's being silent today, I don't know why. Now here's something interesting, uh, pecans, uh, in shell pecans, I don't know anybody that's that big of a fan of pecans. We've got these specialized coolers that keep your drinks cold for a year. Somebody once said, if you need a cooler to keep your beer cold for three days, you're not drinking it fast enough. Can't argue with that one. Well, I guess you got your own little Bucky's Fun Straw. Put that up there to your mouth and it looks like you got a, a, a little beaver face there. That's going to do it for me here at Bucky's in Richmond, Kentucky. I'm going to end it right here in the middle of the store behind the big Bucky here. And I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed it. Checking this place out. I know it's just a gas station. What's the big deal? But it's an experience to come out here to Bucky's. If you got one close by or whatever where you're at, I highly recommend going to them. They're, 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 uh, uh, it's quite an interesting adventure going into these places. So I want to thank you for joining me, and I will catch you guys next time. See you.